Morning, shot with Mick Miller here. I um, hope you're all well. What we're doing this morning is a um, bit of vermin and pest control on the little field, little small holding that we shoot on. Uh, problems with um, uh, corvids and uh, pigeons as well. So we're sort of like set up there. You can see the setup what we've got here. We've got pigeons out there. We've got some uh, um, crow decoys as well. Not there's much crows about Jack at the moment, is there? Mm. More magpies, anything else? But uh, but yeah. So um, yeah, it's working quite well. Can't um, stress the importance of that magpie decoy that's worked really well this morning so far. Um, certainly brings them in. A lot of um, woodland over here, and you get a lot of vermin coming from that. And, uh, so yeah, so uh, we made a start. Um, uh, had a few shots, and we chat. Mm -hmm. um, so we're going to press on today. Uh, cartridge we're using. Jack's using high flyer fives. Um, just gives him a bit of the the edge here. If there is corvids about, five shot does uh, does. Um, a good job. He also uses the Ely Pigeon HV 32 grams. Yeah, he uses that. And what I'm using is Ely Grand Prix uh, 6 32 gram. The reason I'm using this is the game shooting season will be upon us in the blink of an eye. So I'm just using my game shooting cartridges just to get get leads with them a little bit. So I just bed in with them. And um, yeah, so uh, yeah, it's a woodpecker jack. There he is, look. Oh, you missed it, sorry. Nope. Go on. Um, oh, we're in with the wildlife as usual. Um, but yeah, so we're going to see how we get on today. We're only going to be um, shooting this for a couple of hours. Then we'll try and find um, uh, some problems with pigeons on the farm. So we'll have a little look around there um, and see what's, uh, you know, see what's happening. And uh, yeah, good. Hope you enjoy. Magpie Jack, get ready, get your gun. Get your gun, it's coming this way, mate. See it? Over the scrap heap? Yep. Still coming? Yep. Go on then, give it hell. Wait, wait, wait. Now. Shot. Good shot. Pigeon, 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 pigeon. Got it. Lovely. Another pigeon jack. It's gone around. Oh, magpie, go on. Go on. And again. Shot. Oh, Good shot. Doing here is um calling uh actually calling the uh the corvids in with uh, we use basically crow and a jackdaw call, don't you? Yep. Um, Jack and he's got it pretty well sussed out if you try the um, the jackdaw one first of all because the magpies are actually coming in with the uh, jackdaw caller that Jack does so go on mate give it a blast yep. show the viewers what you can do <coughs> so, well done mate well done you want a crow? yeah do the crow Brilliant. Mm. It does work. Uh, yeah. Um, right, you're getting hungry, Jack, are you? Yeah. All right, we better get the field kitchen open then and get some cooking on the go. Nice. <laughs> right, here we are. The field kitchen is now open. You can see we're cooking some uh, nice sausages. Got to keep, keep the troops fed. So Jack will be coming along in a minute. And he's obviously getting hungry. Look at that, it's coming on there. Here he comes. Looking very hungry. You right, mate? Yeah. Good magpie there, I saw you get there, Jack. Yeah. Mm. You all right there, Jack? The sausage sandwich mm. from the field kitchen. Yeah. Strikes again. <laughs> Very nice setup we've got around here. 
Cat mm. one the go. All right, let's get a cup of tea on the go then, shall we? Mm, nice. Excellent. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Yes, it is. Right, this is uh, part two of the video. We are on some pea stubble now. And um, I must admit, there's quite a bit of grub out here for the bird. Fortunately, um, it's being cultivated over. But, um, but yeah, come out here, Jack. Look here. You see, you've got peas. And they started to they started to, to shoot there, yeah, the old rooks and um, crows and jackdaws love them and pigeons as well. But, uh, we're going to give this a go Jack aren't we for a bit and see what see what happens, I mean we've only got a little bit of time and the old uh, tractor will be, uh, be on us, so uh, yeah, yeah we we'll give it another sort of like 10-15 minutes and see how it goes. Okay, it looks keen. Yes. Right, it's a pigeon coming our way, Jack. It's two. Yeah. Another one. Oh. <laughs> Go on. And again. Right, one's coming in. Shot. Good shot, man. Cheers. Really good shot. I take it that was a three quarter. Nope, four and a quarter. Bloody hell. Okay. Yeah, what's with the five? Yeah. Where? Oh yeah. Hang on, you take the right hand one. Go on. <laughs> shot. Well done. All right. That's it for our uh, hunting today. We've uh, ended up on a couple of very nice big carrion crows. Well done. Which is really good. But it wouldn't be possible without the crow coolers. So this one is the Nordic, which I use the most. It's a really, really good, nice, deep sound, you know. Perfect for any just crows flying over the head and then the other one is uh, HCME which is just about a big company that does these in packs which is just um, this is also a crow cooler but we use it multi-purpose for jackdaws as well so if you squeeze it together it makes a loud squeaky noise which is very very close to the original yeah very good very good uh, and then I've got a few other ones on there that we use now and again but they're the two main ones but, oh, trust me, you wouldn't have got them nice big crows today if you wouldn't have used them crow callers. So I'm very pleased with that. Well done, mate. Well done. And uh, and what with the uh, magpies this morning, what with four magpies, mm. and I had a crow as well. So, yeah, yeah, we knocked over a few crows, a few magpies. So it hasn't been a red letter day, Jack. We've struggled a little bit, mate, haven't we? I think yeah. there's so much food. Everywhere we look on these fields, there's just tons and tons of peas and wheat and rape and everything else and uh, yeah yeah but um, at the end of the day got a few shots out of the gun and you've also done done your job with the, uh, the Corvids so yeah, well done certainly. well done the old MK6 is working well mate isn't it? Mm, very well yep okay so uh, yeah done well there Jack mm, yeah special thanks to all subscribers everyone that comments and likes and everything like that it's all recognised and we really appreciate it Lots of good viewings at the moment as well, and the subscriber counts going sky high. Really nice to see. So uh, yeah, we're going to have another video out in a week's time, and uh, yeah, that'll be it. See you in a bit.